Hey, it's Jen of the Kick-Ass Website Coach, and here is another question um, about setting up the payments inside your um, MarketPress shopping cart and your WordPress website. So, um, for everybody who gets one of these sites that I've set up for them, they have this document that includes links to all of the videos that should help to set these things up, and um, for this particular case my client is using PayPal it's also what I used um, so I'm a little more familiar with this one but inside of the document <clears throat> you're gonna wanna scroll down to where it says shopping cart you're gonna wanna watch the videos that are at that link I'm gonna click on that link and you'll see it takes you to the market press list of videos help tutorials that they have created um, if you scroll down here to number six and you click here and you click on that it takes you to this one um, somehow I just enlarged that which is not what I was trying to do um, if you forward I think it's to about the two thirty two minute thirty mark um, it gets to the PayPal settings right here, the PayPal settings. Um, and so these settings actually show up in your dashboard when you go to products. And then you go down to store settings. You're going to come up here to payments. You're going to click on PayPal Express Checkout. And it brings up the information down here. Um, what you're going to be looking for is this line right here where it says instructions. So you're going to want to click on that. And it's going to take you to this page. And if you scroll down, it shows you exactly what you have to do. You're going to have to go to your PayPal account, click on my account, click on profile find where it says my selling tools you, you can also find it over here on this side of your screen when you get there and then um, you're gonna get a new screen and you're gonna have to request your API credentials you're gonna and read through this don't go just by what I'm saying but read through this um, you should once you've requested those you should um, come up with this information and you, what you're gonna do inside your store settings is you're going to want to come down here and you're going to copy your um, your API username you're going to copy this of course you can't do this this is nobody's information um, you're going to copy those things right into the username the password and the signature and then you're going to save the changes now the stuff that's located down below that these are things that you can do to enhance the actual page that you land on when you check out um, but they're not necessary um, they're just kind of fun stuff if you want to enhance it and make it match your site a little bit more you can do that the most important thing is this information here which is shown on this page which is shown when you click on this link at the end of where it says the pay PayPal API credentials. I know it can be a little overwhelming and a little wordy, so like I said, uh, scroll down here, use the pictures, it should give you what you want, okay?